friends, my name is Kim and you're watching All Things Kimberly. Well, today is our first Shout Out Sunday. I am so excited to get started on these savings challenges. You guys just don't know how badly I need to get back on track. I have been doing okay, but I've been not been doing great. I do much better when I'm on track, stuffing my savings challenges, making it fun. I save so much more. Okay, let's take a look. So I pulled out $200 to get started. Now all of this will not go into here. Some of this money will go into my savings challenge book, which I was supposed to have gotten up yesterday and I did not get. Maybe it will go up tomorrow. It's not Saturday, but hey, you gotta do what you can do. 20, 40, 50, 60, 70, 80, 5, 95, 100, 5, 10, 15, 20, 5, 35, 45, 55, 65, 75, 85, 90, 5, and we got some ones. I usually don't use ones. 96, 97, 98, 99, 100. But this is what money I came up with. That's what we're gonna use. So we're gonna work with what we have, you guys. All right. I am so excited to get started on this book. You just do not know. Ah, uh, so happy. Okay, first up, show me the Love Savings Challenge. This is from 40 Plus Life. And I decided for every like, I would save 25 cents. So we're gonna take a look at what we got last week on when I announced this. That's what we've got to start with. Next week, it will be on this video. So like, 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 like. Make sure you like this video so I can save me some money. Okay, let's take a look. Okay, I don't know where my iPad is, so I'm having to pull out my laptop to find out, to find out what my likes were last week. I should have did this beforehand, but I did not. I did not. So we're going to do it together. All righty. So how has everyone been doing? Are you saving money? Are you staying on budget? It is close to the first of the year and we've got to get back on track, you guys. If you're like me, you have fallen off track. I know some of you have not, but I certainly have. And it's just been due to the craziness in my life. I'm telling you, mm, I've got to figure out how to slow down. And I have been. I've not been taking as many side hustle runs, but you know, that's not good either. I need that money. But you gotta do what you gotta do. Let's see, here we go. Here's this video. I put it up six days ago. Get 50% off in it for the commercial. Long, it had 48 likes. All right, that's pretty good, but I know you guys can do better. All right, let's pull this calculator I got right here beside me. 48 likes times 0.25. 12. I think my battery is getting dead on that, but that's what it says. It says 12. So I don't. I don't generally do ones, but since we have them here, I'll go ahead and use them. So 10, 11, and $12. And I'm gonna pull my pretty pen from black and blue. And we're gonna add $12, and that was 48 likes. Yes, we are. Now, what am I gonna save the locks for? Hmm, you know I like to give all of my dollars a job. So, I think we will save this one for, for let's see, show me the love. Saving for Well, I do love, my favorite thing I love, other than my family and my husband and friends, is travel. So let's do this one for travel. Yes, we will. Okay, up next is from Craft by Free, which is Budget with Free, 
on YouTube, Craft a Buffery on Etsy. Here are the acrylic dice or epoxy, I'm not sure. And let's see what we've pulled here. Looks like a, a three and a blank. Yeah, so let's find that here. Right here's one, three and a blank. And I have mine laminated. So what we're gonna do is just, I think, cross them out. So if I'm doing this correctly, that means I need to save $3 for the three. One, two, and three. Oh, if y'all just don't know, it feels so good to stuff an envelope again. It's been too long for me. Too long. Okay, three dollars. Now, what I didn't do is pull out something to keep my dominoes I use up in. So, I've got this extra acrylic five by five, or I think it's four by four. I'm gonna just throw them in there and keep them. Okay. Oh, we need to put what we're saving this one for. Um, dominoes, let's save this for, let's save this for our one month ahead. Saving for one month ahead. Alrighty. Okay. Next, we have our beautiful butterfly savings challenge. This is from Lisa Grateful Me or Happy Mailbox Co. on Etsy. loved this challenge so much the first time I did it, I had to put it in here to do it again. We're going to start out with purple. And I think I will do, I think I'll go ahead and do the $1 ones. So what you do is you color in the $1 one in purple down here so you won't forget. And then you go up here and you color. There we go. One, two, three. You save quite a bit on this a savings challenge. I forget exactly how much, but you see you've got a hundred, two hundred dollars just in fifties. So you end up saving a lot of money. Let's get all our $1 ones and we will have them finished. Can you guys believe, I think somebody said that we're only, what, nine or 10 weeks away from Christmas. Oh my gosh, are you guys ready? Have you started? I haven't. I know my one set of grandbabies are wanting a vacation, a Christmas vacation. One, two, three, four, five, six dollars. And we are out of our one, so we're just going to do five. I want to explain to you how I do my budgeting. I don't do it like anyone else that I know of. I might. Parts of it are on my budgets. If I want to do low budget, it's what I'm going to do in my savings challenge book. 20 and under, I do exactly what it is. But like, if I didn't want to do, if I wanted to do this one low budget, the 50 would be five plus zero equals five. Or you can do it another way by half in it. What you do is decide that before. But since I don't use dollars usually, I round up round down. Since this is six, it's closer to five than it is to 10. So we're stuffing five dollars. I have my own little quirks and twerks the way I do things. 
that just works for me. And that's what you have to do because you don't have to do, I used to be a perfectionist and I had to do things perfectly. Well, if I couldn't do them perfectly, I wouldn't do them. Well, I have found that even doing it imperfectly is a lot better than not doing it at all. Right? Right. Okay. Up next, we're on to the Butterfly Savings Challenge. And this is a scratch off and it is by my good friend, see if you can see it here, Gentle Charm Budgets on Etsy and YouTube, I believe. <laughs> Goodness, excuse me. And you have this whole entire box. I guess there is 30 little butterflies. And we're just going to start at the top and scratch one off. How cute, you guys. Let's see. I don't think my scratcher is in here, but we can use my letter opener. Well, if I don't throw it in the floor, we can use it. Hold on. All righty. So, woo, right off the bat, 21. Woo, that's a big chunk there, Miss Heather. Okay, so we're gonna do this one my low budget way. So that would be three, and as you know, I round up, which is gonna be five. We are gonna mark off the 21 because we have found this little butterfly. And I'm gonna put this at the bottom of the box because if I decide I wanna do this one again, it doesn't bother me one bit that it's not a scratch off. I'll just exit out and do it again, put a sticker over it however I need to. So that is how we'll do it. And if you do it the correct way, well, I shouldn't say the correct way because any way you want to do it is the correct way. But if you do it the way it's set out to be, you would say 465. Now, I won't save that much because I'm not doing it exactly that way. But that's okay. Any amount you save is, is good. Any amount you save is good. Okay. Now, I don't have anything to write on for this one, but I think this one... Well, I can write it on here, can I? I'm gonna save this one to give a boost to my grandbabies. Grandbabies, and they are my critters, but people think I'm talking about four-legged critters when I say that, that haven't watched my channel for a while. So, <laughs> I'm just gonna write grandbabies. <laughs> Next up is our Sidekick 2, and these are from my good friend Tanya at Tanya's Budget and Chaotic Life. On YouTube and on Etsy, and these are gorgeous, you guys. Look at that. Gorgeous, and her and Heather have both done such an amazing job on their laminating and how you do these. Okay. On these, the Sidekicks, I think she has two sets, Sidekicks and Sidekicks 2. I got the two. What you do is you turn it over and you read and it will tell you what to save. What is the screensaver on your phone? Spouse, partner, save $10. Well, that's what mine is. It is me and my husband. So, but if it weren't children, grandchildren, you would save five, pets, save three, Place or landscape, save two. None of these, save a dollar. That's how you do it. So, I'm saving $10. There we go. We're putting it at the bottom. How fun is that? Love it. $5 inside, or $10 in Sidekicks 2. We are going to save Sidekicks 2 for what? Hmm. I think we'll save Sidekicks 2. I'm gonna put a note in here so I don't forget. I think we're gonna save Sidekicks 2 to give a boost to something in sinking funds. And that might be low sinking funds or high sinking funds. High priority, I should say, or low priority. But sinking funds 
nonetheless. All right. Up next, we have the 1960 Vintage Retro Christmas Mini Scratch-Offs from Ellie on Earth. I absolutely love Ellie on Earth, you guys. This is where you come into the pocket of in the back of my little book. So, this is the one I chose to start with. It says you'll save $60.00. And of course, this is gonna to go toward Christmas. I'm not even gonna write it on here because you can see Mr. Santa Claus right there, and that's where this is gonna go. So very first one, $5, that is perfect. Yay. And I made the dashboard on Ellie's uh, YouTube, no, on Ellie's Etsy, Etsy shop, you get the scratch off, but I made my own dashboard, so. Just wanted to put that on there so you didn't think that if you ordered from it, you would get the dashboard. But what an amazing buy these are. Make sure you check out Miss Ellie on Earth, both places, please. Okay, now I got this as a freebie and it was, was it from Ellie? I think it was. If I'm wrong, I'm sorry. I'm thinking it was from Ellie though, but uh Yes, I even wrote it on here, Ellie on Earth. I don't know if I've mentioned it before, but I call my husband Honey Bear. So see, Honey Bear, <laughs> I made that dashboard. And I went ahead, even though this was a freebie, and I'm using it for one of the savings challenges. And we're gonna go ahead and scratch this one right here on the Honey Pot. And it's for $4, so we're gonna round up to five. And we're gonna save this one. I thought of something, what was it? I'm thinking I was saving, saving it for travel too since it was something for me and him both, but I've already put that on there. So let's do anniversary on this one, you guys. I like to make sure that I know where everything is supposed to go. Okay, that way it is for him and me. I don't want it to go toward his per se allowance money, but just something else. It could do birthday, but I think we'll just do anniversary. Okay, the next one up is from Miss Budget by Dina US. And I think she is starting a YouTube channel and she does have the Etsy shop. Now, Dina re reached out to me on Etsy and we chatted back and forth and she was just getting started. So I wanted to make sure I supported her shop. So let's, it says we're gonna save $40 and it says, hello winter, $6. So we're gonna save five. And I must say all these scratch offs for all these ladies have scratched off beautifully and they are really, really great stuff. Okay, so I made this dashboard. Had to have those little penguins in there and we are gonna save this one for what? Let me think. I think we're gonna save this one for, I want to start a new category called miscellaneous, unbudgeted, stuff like that, to just give a buffer. That's it, the word, buffer. I wanna save this toward my buffer. Okay. And I think that's all I have in here so far, you guys. Yes, it is. And I hope you have enjoyed watching my first savings challenge in forever. Now in the back of my books, I like to put what I call notes. And what I like to do here, if some of you are wondering about my books, most of them have a notes page. So here's what I like to do for low budget, amounts 
20 and below exact. 21 and up, add numbers together. I like to set out my rules when I start a savings challenge. That way I don't, I'm like I said, I'm a perfectionist. So I have to give myself rules if I'm not going to do it the exact way or I feel out of sorts. Does that make sense to you guys? So I like to set things out and try to stick with it. So that is the way I'm going to do it. Also round up or down to not use ones. Okay, that's my rules for this savings challenge book. I hope you guys have enjoyed getting me back on track. I appreciate you so very much. Please remember to like, where is it? Like, 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 like. Get those likes up for me, guys, so we can save lots of money like and subscribe and leave me a comment and above all else enjoy the journey bye for now